A jewel heist worth thousands of dollars kicks off tonight's Perp Patrol, and it is the second time that this business has been hit. Here now with this week's rundown is Liz Bishop. Two captures this week on the Perp Patrol, bringing to 273 now the number of cases closed since we began. Colony police tell me U.S. Marshals picked up William White in Arizona after a tip from a Perp Patrol viewer led police to look for him out of state. Bennington police tell me Christopher Corot turned himself in after seeing himself on the Perp Patrol. Now let's see what you can do with this week's entries, and we start with a local antique shop that was hit once before and featured right here on the Perp Patrol. This video was taken of a man who ripped off the stone soup gallery in Boston Spa. He pried open a small lock to a display case and took a variety of jewelry, some of which you're seeing here, totaling over $4,500. If you know this guy, give Boston Spa Police a call at 885-5111. Schoharie County Probation Department is trying to track down 23-year-old Matthew Bergeron in connection with three active court warrants there. He's six feet tall. His last known address was State Route 7 in Cobleskill. If you know where to find him, call probationer Nathan Wood at 295-2274. Colony police are after 23-year-old Anthony Tolbert for violating conditions of his drug court sentencing. He was originally picked up for selling crack cocaine at a Wolf Road motel. His last known address was in the city of Cahos, and he has tattoos of Ant Jr., Princeland, Never Scared, and R.I.P. Lindell. You can reach Colony Police at 783-2754. And Glenville Police want your help finding 32-year-old Tiffany Lucia. They say she was involved in a larceny at the Glenville Walmart. And when she was arrested, they say they found her in possession of cocaine and pot. She's 5'5", 125 pounds, with a last known address of Barrett Street in Schenectady. You can reach Glenville Police at 384-3444. So that's a look at this week's entries. You can see those mug shots again on our website, cbs6albany.com, and we'll update the totals next week. Liz Bishop with your Perpetual for CBS 6 News.